Moundsville Penitentiary, a haunting glimpse into West Virginia's dark past. Moundsville Penitentiary, located in Moundsville, West Virginia, is a place steeped in a haunting history that stretches back over a century. This imposing Gothic-style prison served as a home to some of the most notorious criminals in the region and bore witness to a multitude of horrific events. Today, it stands as a relic of West Virginia's dark past and is known for its gruesome tales of violence, despair, and the paranormal. Let's take a glimpse into the past. Moundsville Penitentiary, also known as the West Virginia State Penitentiary, opened its doors in 1876. It was designed to be a place of punishment and rehabilitation for the state's most dangerous criminals. The prison was constructed with a daunting facade that echoed the foreboding atmosphere within its walls. Its castle-like turrets and looming towers were designed to intimidate, reflecting the harsh conditions and strict discipline within. This gave birth to much horrors within the walls. Throughout its operation, Moundsville Penitentiary witnessed a multitude of horrors, both inhumane and gruesome. The prison was notorious for its violent inmates, harsh punishments, and brutal living conditions. Overcrowding was a constant issue, leading to unsanitary conditions and a high risk of disease. Inmates often endured extreme physical and psychological abuse, with floggings and solitary confinement being common punishments. Perhaps the most infamous horror of Moundsville Penitentiary was the death penalty. The prison executed 85 individuals through various means, including hanging, electrocution, and lethal injection. The last execution occurred in 1959, after which West Virginia changed its execution methods, eventually abolishing the death penalty altogether in 1965. Harry F. Powers, born Harm Drenth, November 17, 1893, March 18, 1932, was a Dutch-born American serial killer who was hanged in Moundsville. Among the wretched lives murdered, a leader of the Aryan Brotherhood, William Red Snyder, Red for short, was violently stabbed 37 times in his cell. A total of 998 deaths occurred in the Moundsville Penitentiary, so some say that still linger. Moundsville Penitentiary's grim history along with its eerie architecture, has contributed to its reputation as one of the most haunted places in the United States. Reports of paranormal activity have been widespread, attracting countless ghost hunters and enthusiasts. Some of the most chilling stories involve ghostly apparitions, unexplained sounds, and sudden drops in temperature. Many visitors have claimed to have experienced the sensation of being watched, touched, or even pushed by unseen entities. The infamous Shadow Man is one of the most well-known ghostly figures said to haunt the prison. Described as a tall, shadowy figure that appears in various parts of the penitentiary, it has left many visitors unsettled. Moundsville Penitentiary Today In 1995, Moundsville Penitentiary closed its doors as a functioning prison due to overcrowding, inhumane conditions, and a slew of lawsuits. Since then, the facility has been open for public tours, allowing visitors to explore its eerie corridors and learn about its dark history. The tours offer a glimpse into the lives of inmates and the horrors they endured, as well as the possibility of encountering paranormal activity. Moundsville Penitentiary stands as a chilling testament to the horrors of the past. Its history is marked by violence, suffering, and death. The prison's ominous architecture and tales of paranormal activity have turned it into a macabre tourist attraction. While the prison no longer houses inmates, its dark history and the legends of the paranormal continue to captivate and terrify those who dare to enter its haunted halls, providing a glimpse into a past that will never be forgotten.